I consider myself pretty contented. I have a job so I can take care of myself. I have a family that loves me. I have a hobby that makes my mundane day more exciting. My life looks pretty much figured out, or so I think. There's something I recently just started to notice and began to question. Do I feel happy? Oh, okay. So if you're a person who roams the internet frequently and interested in looking past the border, you will see places that spied with different cultures and philosophies to share mutual interests with each other. For example, people want to get rich. Many of us want to stay in good shape, be famous, or become more influential. You get the idea. So, will we ever feel happy enough? The keyword here is enough. I was born as a boy and supposed to grow up as a man. But even in many societies today, being a man is not well respected enough. You also need to be good looking or having social status or some kind of influences. That is also why social media has developed so fast. Hey, wanna go out? So what happened when a man failed to meet these standards? The thing is, in reality, hardly many men could actually fit the expectations that they think they would need to feel happy enough. Same could be said about women as well. I have heard stories of people that have fallen into deep depression just because they can't satisfy the expectations that they created for themselves. If you look around, you will see many people that aren't good looking or successful. People that aren't rich, don't hold a job that makes six figures, but still can be happy with what they have. It turns out that all of us are deeply flawed. So who are we comparing ourselves to? Exactly nobody. We waste our time being miserable, feeling lesser. So how do I feel happy? Happiness is actually a choice that we can make. Not bad, huh? Looking good. But don't be mistaken, loving yourself doesn't mean we're gonna sit around and be proud of the unimprovement. Could be better. Yes, for today. If I can't solve a problem today, leave it for tomorrow, but I would not abandon it. It would be much to ask a blind man to describe what he sees in the garden. But can a blind man sing? What could ever be better than hearing your own voice singing? Well, except that your voice truly sucks. Does that mean we're actually not good enough? Wrong. We just simply accept our flaws, knowing our right to exist. That imperfection is a motivation and we still have space to grow. If you know you can run for another mile, why wouldn't you? And why shouldn't you? You could be healthier. You could have lower chance to have a heart attack. Have you never made your bed after waking up? Well, now is a good time. <sighs> B 
been the best of myself is how I say happy. Thank you very much.